Hello, my lovely friends. My name is Ava, and here is my ebook haul for April. I downloaded a lot of free books in April, so there's no like Kindle Limited haul in this video because normally I split up my ebook hauls for the month by Kindle Limited downloads and then books I got for free. These are all free books, and there are a lot. Um, but don't worry, later on in the month, I'm going to be having a video dedicated to all of the Kindle Unlimited books I currently have checked out and me talking about all those books. So stay tuned for that. But today I'm going to be talking about the very many books I got for free in April. And that's mainly because of Stuff Your Kindle Day was in April. So I got quite a few books for free. <laughs> By the way, all the books that I'm going to be talking about today are going to be linked down below. So if one interests you, you can click the link below and it'll take you right to the Amazon page um, to go get it. So yeah, let's get into these books. The first one that I would love to talk about is Wed to the Wolfman by Carl Wilde. This is one of the books in the Monster Romance series that Leila Fay has with a few other authors, Kara Wilde being one of them. I don't think I've read any of the books by this author before. In this series, it's just a series about arranged marriages between humans and like monster creatures and who has the best like genetic match. So that's why I got this one. Icebreakers by H.C. Cardona is next, which is a hockey mystery book interesting it's still currently available to download for free if you're interested it looks like mika here is a private investigator and something happened um on this hockey team and she has to talk to her ex-boyfriend who is also an nhl player in order to get the 411 on everything this cover just like it spoke to me this is johnny by rachel dunning this is a friends to lovers new adult romance and it's still available to download for free so it looks like our heroine is going through a little bit of a hard time at home her dad is becoming an alcoholic and is becoming violent towards her and so she turns to her best friend to help her and then things i guess roll from there can we talk about this man's eyes like whoo Pearson. Next is Final Serenade by N.N. Britt. This is an age gap rock star romance and it is still available to download for free. Our hero in here, Frankie, was a very famous rock star seven years ago, but then he got in an accident and that has kind of had him become a recluse. He doesn't want to leave the house, but then he ends up meeting our heroine and things kind of shift for him. And then the prop paparazzi get wind of this relationship and they try and keep it a secret. I don't really know, but I'm excited. I haven't really read a lot of Rockstar romances because I don't think it's like my cup of tea, but maybe this one will be. Ivy and Bone by R.L. Perez is next. And this is a Hades and Persephone retelling. Okay, so it looks like our heroine Prue in here is really mourning the loss of her twin sister. And so she's a witch. So she summons the devil the king of the underworld to get her sister back to raise her from the dead um but then cyrus shows up who's kind of like our hades character in here and um she forms this alliance or bond with him um and there's a lot more to it than she anticipated to try and bring her sister back and the two obviously fall for each other the rose and the duke is next and this one is by jillian eaton and this one is available off of kindle limited our heroine lenora in here is not wanting a husband or doesn't have the time for husband she is currently taking care of her younger siblings and they are quite a handful but then our hero here who's a duke he's known for being a rake but the moment that he sets his eyes on our heroine he is gone for her <laughs> and so he's trying to convince her to like let him court her or whatnot and so there's like a push and pull there break the ice by la cotton is next and this is a brother's best friend hockey romance um and i think it's either this one or the next book in the series that has celiac disease representation so i'm fine with either it's either this one or the one before that does i don't know which book in the series this is um but i know tori told me that one of these books has celiac disease representation and like i need that and when i saw this was for free i snatched it up of course in the viscount's arms by allison jeline is next and this one is still available to download for free our heroine octavia becomes the governess to this little girl and her uncle is her um, guardian and it's their romance as a governess guardian romance very scandalous um but i love this trope in historic romances so anytime i see it i just immediately get get the book <laughs> next is return to monte carlo by casey wells this is available off of kindle unlimited i saw casey wells book and just got it a few of her books do come free every once in a while so i would say follow her on instagram and stay up to date on that because she will announce like oh this book is free today that happens a lot for her books i have a few i have like five of her books that i got for free in my kindle library currently sweet temptation by cora kent is next and this one is still currently available for free all the rest of these books i ended up getting on stuff your kindle day so 
buckle up there's a lot this is only a 35 page novella so just be aware of that it apparently sets up the main book in the series so apparently this story is about how our hero and heroine meet like in the first book it's a little prequel and apparently the hero's dad ended up like leaving him and his mom when he was younger and so he wants revenge and the way that he's gonna do that is by seducing his dad's wife then i downloaded curvy girl and the cowboy next door by jessa joy um i saw cowboy and plus size representation and i just i got it this one is available off of kindle limited Ooh, and it looks like a heroine is a plus size model you never read about that and she has to go on a ranch in the middle of nowhere to like take some pictures and stuff, which is where I assume she meets our cowboy hero. The Viking and the Raven by Annie O'Liberty is next. This one is available off of Kindle Unlimited. This is a Viking romance dealing with time travel, which I always love those, like when those are interconnected. I think this book like kind of like takes place in the future where people are able to time travel. So the heroine gets hired as a journalist to go travel back in time to Viking, the Viking era. And then she meets a Jarl who's like, a viking king and falls for him. Braving Revenge by Cece Gelding is next. This one is available off of Kindle Unlimited. It's the first book in a mafia romance series. It looks like a heroine has been kidnapped by a rival Irish mob. This is a novella. Um, it's apparently I think like a prequel um, and it's a part of a dark contemporary romantic suspense Mafia series. Single Dad by L.M. Thomas is next. This one is available off of Kindle Limited. I just saw Single Dad and I was like, click. <laughs> and I also know this is a nanny romance, which I am obsessed with nanny romances. Um, our heroine becomes the nanny to a three-year-old girl named Charlotte. And these two obviously fall for each other like many single dad nanny romances. <laughs> Kiss Beneath the Stars by S.L. Sterling is next. This one is still available to download for free. These two characters end up meeting up on a vacation. They see each other across a bar while they're at vacation, I think at this resort. They have a one night thing that turns into a many night thing while on vacation. And I think feelings start to develop between the two. Next, I have One More Day by M. Malone. This is still available to download for free and it is a single dad small town romance. The summer is kind of vague here, but it looks like this is the romance with our heroine who wants to open up a plant nursery. Her life isn't really going the way she planned right now. And then she ends up meeting our hero who is the single dad, grumpy single dad, to two young boys who are kind of chaotic. <laughs> then I have A Conduit of Light by Chelsea Ann Tompkins. This is available off of Kindle Unlimited. I think this is a quest fantasy romance book dealing with magic. And then the person that the heroine goes on the quest with, the hero like starts to fall in love with her or something. I don't really know, the summary's very vague, but the cover definitely brought me in because that is absolutely stunning. Another stunning cover is Elegy of Twilight by Angela J. Ford. This is also available off of Kindle Unlimited. So this is the romance with a priestess who is like forbidden to fall in love and with a vampire king. Ooh, just that one line pulled me in. I am sold. I want to read this right now. Moonlight Beauty by Anna Santos is next. And this one is also on Kindle Unlimited. It's a Beauty and the Beast retelling as well. Our heroine Belle in here um, really wants revenge for these beasts who killed her father. And so she wants to join this group of hunters that their village has, but women are not allowed in it. And so she kind of convinces the captain of them, like, I'll let you court me because she knows that he's in love with her, which is like, I guess the Gaston character in here. She's like, I'll let you court me in exchange. You will train me and I could possibly become the first huntress. Um, but then on her first mission, something happens and she gets kidnapped by some of these beasts. Finding Lord Farlyle is next. This one is by Cassandra Dean and it is still currently available to download for free. This one has the amnesia trope and it looks like our hero 11 years ago was in a shipwreck and he lost all of his memory including the way he feels about our heroine who is his like childhood love of his life. I love a good amnesia trope, so. Plucked by the Orc by Jenna Larkin is next. This one is available off of Kindle Unlimited. You have a Regency romance mixed with a monster romance. Yes, please. And I think our hero is of the aristocracy and he's gonna try and kind of do a makeover on our heroine to make her a part of the ton or something like that. And he ends up falling in love with her. Sounds really good. The Malevolent Fairy by Rebecca F. Kenny is next. This is the second book in the Beauty and the Beast retelling series. I know it's the second book in a series, but um, I just saw Rebecca F. Kenny's name. I read a few of her fantasy romances and I actually really enjoy them. So I just saw one of them for free and got it. Monstrous Bond by Harper a. Brooks is next. It's available off of Kindle Limited. It's a monster romance. It looks like a heroine ends up falling into like a portal where the hero is and things like happen and they end up actually getting bonded together when they're both like hot and bothered. <laughs> so 
I don't know what's gonna happen there. Next is Defended by the Alpha by Luna Wilder. Werewolf romance, obviously. This one is also on Kindle Limited and it looks like to be the first book in a series. Our heroine ends up running a cabin in Alaska to get a break from her life and from her stalker. She thinks she's being stalked by someone. And when she wakes up in the morning after her like first night there, she finds a, the man looming over her and is terrified until he tells her like, oh, I'm not your stalker, I'm your faded mate, honey. Like, I found you. <laughs> Sounds so fun. Burn With Me by D.L. Darby is next. This one is available off of Kindle Unlimited. It looks like our two characters end up meeting at this club, like club, you know, club. Um, and everyone is like forced to wear masks, but then they don't have a great first meeting and they kind of hate each other, but then it turns into hate doing it or something. Sounds hot. Off the Line by Chris Riley is next. This one is available off of Kindle Unlimited. Oh, I remember why I downloaded this. I just saw Soccer Star. And I don't get a lot of soccer romances, like good soccer romances. So I literally just got it because it said one of them was a soccer player. I also got Birthday Shot by Rilsley Adams. This one's available off of Kindle Limited. I saw a free Rilsley, Rilsley, sorry, sometimes I mix up her name, um, Rilsley Adams book and I got it immediately. I know Brie from In Love and Words loves this book. She read this book on her birthday last year. And so I, I, I just got it. I saw her name and I saw free and I was like, let's do it download it. And the last book that I have is Choke by Charity Parkerson. This one is still available to download for free. It looks like this is just like a 95 page novella. It's a prequel to the series. It's a sports romance. Our hero, one of our heroes, it's actually an MM romance, got in a career ending football injury on the field. And it's a bi awakening book. And I think the other hero is like, a news reporter or something like that and like is getting under his skin. Anyways, there you have it. Those are all the books that I ended up downloading last month for free. Let me know down below if you've read any of these books or if you plan to. And if you don't feel like commenting anything else, you can leave me a football emoji in the comment section down below. But anyways, thank y'all so, so much for watching. I will see y'all soon in my next one. Bye y'all.